As we just saw with your daughter, thanks to the trotter, she's having fun while exercising because it's a toy that stimulates her both physically and mentally. When I say physically, she's discovering her balance in her surroundings. She'll be active in an environment engaging her sight, sound, smell, and touching the ground realizing how hard it is. Furthermore, she will learn to stand up straight and move about on two feet. You can see her pedaling standing up, which stimulates her muscles. It also stimulates locomotion. She's using both legs alternately and leaning on her arms. You can see her disassociating her upper and lower limbs. You can tell your daughter is looking for support to explore the world. Her problem is with muscle strength, so she will build this strength in the experience she will have through active movement on the ground. Upright balance is only a question of physics with gravity challenging her body. With the trotter, she can rest seated while pushing with her feet on the ground. This is the basic foundation in her learning to walk. It's cool! It will lead to walking because first she sits, then begins pushing. The trotter is ergonomically correct to fit her shape. Most trotters are too wide which separate their hips whereas Glober enables the natural walking position. She's experiencing a similar motion as rocking or a swinging sensation. You told me there are three wheels on the trotter. Well, the back wheel has a little thing you can press on. Come on, press it with your foot. Well, if you press it, the scooter doesn't move. It blocks the wheel. When you're driving around, press it and you will stop. What I like about it is that it has a brake. This is really rare in a three-wheel scooter because when they get to move to a two-wheel scooter, they have to master both balance and their foot to brake. Whereas with this scooter, it trains them in this way. She's learning locomotion, balancing on one leg, while propelling herself with the other. They have the support, so they don't need to concentrate on balance as much. It's great. There are different positions and ways to use it. When with their parents, it is a safer way to discover their new environment. In their second phase, when they will be able to do it by themselves, we'll put it in trotter mode just like this, and they will be able to move around by themselves. They will be self-sufficient discovering their new environment. When you're on the trotter and you want to turn, you will lean on your arms and use your balance to shift left or right with your legs and upper body.